The latest episodes of Waterborne are taking the team to the Grand Cayman Islands in the Caribbean to film episode 5 and episode 6. For these new episodes, we're able to get a hand on the new housing system by Nauticam, the Epic LT Underwater Housing. Instantly, you can tell that the size of the housing is significantly smaller and lighter in comparison to any other red housing that's out there in the market. It's incredibly hydrodynamic, easy to use. The controls are absolutely amazing on this. On the left side, you're able to have access to your focus and your zoom quite easily from the handle. And on your right side, you're able to have manual mechanical controls to the red right at your fingertips. Because the housing is approximately one third smaller than any other housing that I've been able to use, it actually packs a lot lighter and smaller. On our last day of shoot, we were in the pool filming just moments before I had to hop on my flight. Within 15 minutes, I was able to break it down, pack it up, and be ready to head to the airport. We were really lucky to have this housing for a number of reasons. I was able to film at one of the deepest depths that I've ever filmed on, at about 100 feet, filming Kirk do a flyby on a scooter right across the Atlantis submarine. And this is something that would have been either extremely difficult, definitely more dangerous, and possibly not even possible with, with something bigger. On episode 6, I was trying to navigate a set that involved up to eight, nine freedivers at a time. I, as the camera operator, would go through all these divers and having the in-water handling and the agility and the minimal drag really helped me have a very easy and fluid workflow in which I didn't even have to really think about the camera as it was able to just become a part of me. Being underwater just gives you a new perspective, a new feeling, and really is able to show you things that you wouldn't be able to above water. And to be able to actually further capture that and share that experience with other people is part of what Waterborne is all about. <laughs>